Hey guys, Anthony here with a tutorial on how to morph 3D models in PowerPoint 2016. Microsoft introduced an online 3D community called Remix 3D and the 3D model used in this tutorial is from Remix 3D. You'll find the link in the description section. So I've got PowerPoint 2016 open here. This is the Office 365 version. Let's start by adding the 3D model that I just showed you. In the Insert tab and under the 3D models, you will see two options. I'll choose the online sources. This will take us to the Remix 3D models. Bear in mind that you will need to be connected to the internet. You can use the search box to search for a specific 3D model. I'll search for Home and then click on the search icon. This is the 3D model that I'm looking for. I'll select it and then insert it. It will then insert the 3D model on the slide. You can then increase the size by dragging its handles and then center it. In this section up top in the Format tab, you will find several 3D model views. And if you drop down the section, you will see all the 3D view options. I'm going to choose this rooftop view. This is the one. Next, I will right click on the slide in the left side panel and choose Duplicate Slide. So I've got my Duplicate Slide here. Next I will click on the 3D model and then go to the Format tab and under the 3D model views I'll choose another 3D view. So here is a new 3D view. Next in the Transitions tab I'll choose the Morph Transition and we can do a quick preview. And this is what the animation looks like. Next, we need to continue the same process, that is, duplicate the new slide by right clicking and then choosing Duplicate Slide. Next, click on the 3D model, go to the Format tab, and change the 3D view. And then repeat the same process for the different views. So I went ahead and created a sequence of slides with different views. And here is how the 3D model morph animation came out.